Hey, Scott Adams here. Today I wanna to talk with you about why it's a bad idea to pay your monthly mortgage payment via a money order. Um, this past week I was speaking to a client when they were a little upset because their mortgage company inside their bankruptcy case was stating or claiming that they were about six months behind on their payments. And the client was upset because they said that I haven't missed six months of payments. I may have missed one, but not six. And so I said, well, this, this really should be an easy fix. Give me copies of your bank statements showing where they cast your payment and we should be able to resolve this pretty easily. Uh, the problem is, is the, the client said, Scott, I didn't pay through my bank account. I mean, I didn't write a check. I didn't have an ACH debit out of my account. I went down to my local grocery store and I bought a money order and I mailed in the money order. But I've got all six of these money orders where I purchased the money order. Will that work? And you know, the problem becomes is it just, it, it, it upsets me, it bothers me because those money orders are really, those receipts they got is nothing more than just a receipt that they went to the store and they bought a money order. And I hated to tell her this, but the last time I spoke to Western Union, they said that for $15 per money order, we can trace research, provide proof of who cast your money order, and it'll take about 30 days if you have the bottom half of your money order receipt. Um, and the problem becomes is that if you don't have the bottom half of your money order money gram receipt, uh, and you've got a store copy of a receipt, it's going to be $30 for each one of those for us to trace, research, and track who um, cashed those checks. And by the way, it's gonna take six to eight weeks to do it. So, you know, it's just, it's not a good idea to get into the habit of buying a money order and mailing it to your mortgage company because if a dispute arises, it's gonna be difficult and it may be expensive for you to track down and provide proof that those payments were cashed by the mortgage company. If you get into a dispute with your mortgage company and you need some, some help, just uh, give me, pick up the phone, give me a call, send me an email. Be glad to sit down and, and maybe work, work through it with you, give you some advice. Um, hope y'all have a, a great day. Thanks.